Welcome to our Swift programming tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when learning to print objects in Swift. Our viewer wants to know the difference between two ways to print a string. Both methods seem to produce identical results, but is there more to it? Let's dive in and explore these two approaches to printing in Swift. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Let's get started. Let's explore two different ways to print an object in Swift. First, we'll look at the string interpolation method. In this method, we use backslashes and parentheses to insert the value of my name directly into the string. This is a clean and readable way to format strings. Now let's examine the second method, which uses a comma to separate the string and the variable. In this approach, we pass multiple arguments to the print function. Swift automatically adds spaces between them, which can be useful for printing multiple items. While both methods produce similar output, string interpolation is generally preferred for its clarity and conciseness. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. In Swift 3, you can print variables using the interpolation syntax. For example, you can use backslashes and parentheses to include variables and strings. Additionally, the print function allows you to print multiple variables with a space in between, known as the separator. You can customize the separator when printing. For instance, you can use a pipe or a custom string to separate the variables. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In Swift 3, there are two ways to print a string with a variable. Both methods yield the same result. Here's an example. If your favorite food is pizza, both print statements will display the same message. And that's it, guys. We've gone through, answered your question, I hope, and you found that resolution. Guys, if this helped, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, have a good one.